not on my phone. My phone records will show that. Now at six, the Oakland mayor defending herself after being involved in a car crash. Jean Kwan says she was hit, but the other driver is telling a different story. Crown Four was the first there at the scene of the crash. This is not the first time that we've reported on Mayor Jean Kwan behind the wheel. She's been caught on her phone twice, but today, one day after the crash, Crown Four's Hazik Madyun reports the mayor offered her version of what happened when the two cars collided. I'm sure I saw it with my own eyes. A witness comes forward verifying Oakland Mayor Jean Kwan's version of what happened just before she was involved in Sunday's car collision here at the intersection of Market and 26th Street. Mayor Kwan says the driver of the other car hit her vehicle. And I was hit um, from the rear um, and it spun my car around. The driver of the other car alleges that Mayor Kwan ran a red light. So that just shows. Like, she's not it just all happened right in front of me. But this off-duty Oakland employee with the city's safety ambassador, Sean Vasquez, just so happened to be parked near the intersection when the accident occurred. It says the mayor had the right of way. The mayor was going across the light on the yellow, and the girl kind of went into the intersection on the red. I guess she, it looked like she was texting on her phone and went into the middle of the street and hit the, the uh, other driver. So you thought you saw the other driver involved in this accident on she their phone? She was paying attention to the road. I saw her on her phone? Yeah, she was paying attention to the road. Now that's a twist because it was just last week, only on Cron 4's People Behaving Badly, that the Oakland mayor was busted on camera behind the wheel with cell phone in hand on two separate occasions. I want to say very clearly, I learned my lesson the week before. I was not on my phone. My phone records will show that. We've submitted those to the police department um, that we are going to let the police department do its investigation. Mayor Kwan says that she will turn over her cell phone records to Oakland police investigators so they can verify her version of the events leading up to the accident. The complete investigation Investigation, including the determination of who was at fault, could take up to as many as two weeks. In Oakland, Hazik Madyun, Cron 4 News. We checked back with the other driver involved in the crash this afternoon who says that the allegations brought up by this new witness are simply untrue. Renee Lovely of Oakland was behind the wheel of the Nissan involved. She insists that she was not on her phone at the time of the collision, but she's also not completely sure Mayor Kwan was either. She does say she saw Kwan holding her hand up to her head as if she were on the phone. And she goes on to say whatever the mayor was doing, it caused her to be distracted, a lesson that she believes Kwan should have learned after being featured in two segments of people behaving badly. When we first talked to the driver of this Nissan Ultima right after the collision Sunday evening, she said she saw the mayor on a cell phone at the time of the crash. She had the cell phone near her ear. She went texting. That driver, Oakland resident Renee Lovely, did not want to talk again on camera. But after hearing that the mayor is now insisting she was not on her phone while behind the wheel, she's not as sure Jean Kwan was talking and driving because she says it all happened so fast. Renee Lovely now says she saw the mayor holding her hand up to her head as if she were on the phone. But whatever she was doing, Lovely believes Mayor Kwan was distracted, and she's still insisting that it was the mayor who ran the light and not her, which is exactly what she told us on Sunday. My light was green, not yellow, no nothing, green, solid green. Lovely says she now has a strained shoulder and lower back pain because of the crash. The 14-year-old boy who was with her at the time of the accident was expected to be checked out by a doctor today. Grant. And as we first told you last week on Cron 4 News, Mayor Kwan has been caught twice using her phone while behind the wheel. A viewer actually sent us this picture showing the mayor holding her phone with both hands looking at the screen. She claimed to be using a navigation app at the time. And once that picture aired, a different person sent us this picture. It shows the mayor holding a phone to her face. And once this second image surfaced, the mayor told our Stanley Roberts that she and her staff think she needs a driver so she can safely and legally tend to city business while traveling to different city events. And we checked with the DMV, which says the mayor's only violation on record is for not stopping at a stop sign. This was last April in Fremont. This morning, the mayor touched on her California driving record during that press conference. She first said she thinks the violation was for rolling through a stop sign, but she later indicated a traffic camera captured her making a right turn 
at a red light. Pam. Keep it here for the latest on the Oakland mayor's crash. It's a story we brought you first on Cron 4. Our reporters working to get to the bottom of what happened. Updates are on the web at cron4.com and on the Cron 4 News app.